I kind of wish that like more of this level was like indoors. It's pretty much all outside, outdoors. Yeah. Which is it's fine, but like I don't know. I just like I just I, I like the architecture. It's not something you see in Mario that often. Imagine. Other than like that one level in the 3D world. Mm. You know the one. I don't because I haven't played 3D world or looked into it. And you know what I say about that? Ba ba da ba 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 da. Sounds like your problem. Yeah. Can't wait. I kind of wanted you to finish it for me. <laughs> <laughs> you think I have my baby? Yeah, I think it's a thing. I just shove my. Yeah. There's a hole in the wall. Mm. I like how you bob when you do that. Anyway. <laughs> That's me giving you a girl cunnilingus. <laughs> oh. It's actually a penis shaped device. You get it because, like, literally everything on Earth that is like a stick shape is a penis. Right. Bet you never made that observation before. Mm. I don't know about what about if it's a stick. I'm making fun of people who think they're funny. Oh. But they're not because they're young. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm the only funny person. No one else is. Hmm. Don't touch me. Over here. It actually just reminds me of, um, that in Assassin's Creed, there's a, like a Japanese one. Oh yeah? You go to Japan and... But there's a, there's a, there's a short animation, um, about ACO's last days. And this, uh, yeah, the Japanese assassin comes in and they talk, and then uh, they part ways. And then Ezio is on a bench, and I think that's when he dies. Hmm. Well, hmm. That's uh, cool. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. What do you want me to say? Yeah. No, I got. <sighs> Hmm? Don't worry. Yeah, I like the angle that you came into the thing as. Did you down catch the fire a little bit? Um, what gave that away? What makes you think that? Yeah, it's just so heavily tattooed now. Yeah. I have tattoos that come and go. I'm, oh. like, a, I'm like a siren from Borderlands. Remember that? Game? Yeah. <laughs> That's good, because we're still playing it. Yes. Playing two different Borderlands games at once. Yes. After that, we should play Borderlands 1, and then the pre-sequel, and then... I mean, you do want to play the pre-sequel on the channel eventually, don't you? Yeah. We can do that. If you want. <laughs> mm -hmm. All you gotta do is ask. Yeah, all you gotta do is try. All you gotta do is believe in yourself, actually. Whatever you know. Yeah. You don't even have to do that, you just gotta put the effort in. Wait, I mean, you, you can believe, believe in yourself you and not try, and then <laughs> nothing will happen. Yeah, I haven't thought of it that way. You really can just believe in yourself and not try. <laughs> That's what Be I like, do every dang day. So, if you believe in yourself so much, why don't you do the thing that you want to do? Because uh, I just don't feel like it. Yeah, exactly. I believe in myself so much that, that uh, I don't feel like I need to prove anything to anyone. Yeah. So I'm not going to do anything. That's it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do the things that I want to do. I ain't got a thing to prove to you. Uh, eat, what is it? I eat my candy with the pork and beans. Excuse my manners if I make a scene. What the fuck are you talking about? I ain't gonna wear the Eating clothes candy with pork and beans. That sounds fun. Yeah. You're, you're yeah. quoting a song again, aren't you? Yeah. Stephanie? I'm fine and dandy with the me inside. <laughs> what, do you, what do you want me from me? How am I supposed to bounce off of this? I don't know what the words are very to well. To what? What are you talking about? Pork and Beans by Weezer. I don't know. I don't listen to Weezer. I played you the song last time. Oh. Oh, yeah. That's right. <laughs> it's got all the like, YouTube people that mean clips. I'm a YouTube person. You are, but you weren't in 2008 when the song was made. It Wasn't released. I? No. Well, oh, really? Yeah. Are you sure? When was I a YouTube person? Like October 2009. Oh, come on. It's close enough. Mm. <coughs> I do like the you know you think. Oh, wait, yeah, it's, been, it's my, t my 10 year anniversary is probably going, hasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I was going to do something for it, but then I didn't. Yeah. Uh, I can't even remember what it was. <laughs> uh, oh, well. oh, yeah, I want to um, I wanna make a video where I'll, I'll watch through some of my old stuff and provide commentary. Oh. Do you want to do that with me? You can tell me how much you hate them all. 
Yeah, all right. I don't know, that'd be kind of fun. My thing is, I was going to do, well, I will do a, uh, like, do a video on each year in the 10 years, which would be 11 parts long, which would be 2010, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and then, well, no. It'll be 2010 to 19. And then I guess I'll talk a little bit about what I'm going to do in 2020. Which is less. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Striving high. Yeah. I like the way you work, Mimi. You know the guy who did the Leave Brittany Alone video? Yeah. He closed his channel. Oh, In 2015. Really? Oh. Because yeah, look, his Wikipedia page apparently is involved. Uh, I think he was just a bit, um, he was unafraid to be himself. What does that mean? Like, he dressed Is he a pedophile? No, he didn't dress the way he liked and people just thought he was a little bit weird. People think he's weird ever since that video came out. Yeah. Because he like, wears his makeup and he has hair long and things like that and he did things differently. Yeah, but like, why did he close his channel? He's getting bullied too much. Um... I don't know. There isn't actually a thing that explains why he did it. It just says that he did it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. So, true. unless you want to watch videos... I that am glad that you went and looked up his Wikipedia page. Yeah. Someone's got to keep on top of him. Yeah. <laughs> figure out where he is at all times. Yeah. I want to know who the... The, uh... the nostalgia critic is? His name is Doug Walker. <laughs> you wanna know who the the girl is in um uh, hey, there's a girl in the clip and she's looks like she's some sort of game show host. Uh, so I wanna find out who she is. What the game show is? Well no what who the girl is. Oh what? Uh -huh. Alright, let's see how cool we look. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Ram. It's <laughs> <laughs> a pretty nice little area. We're on like a little oasis type thing. I can't get into that building down there unless I buy the rest of the costume, but who gives a ding? Mm. Am I right, fellow gamers? Who gives a freaking ding dong? I am a gamer. Are you really though? Mm. Not because I don't have a life, but because I choose to have many. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. What if I bought both of us a t shirt of that? Would no. You love it? I would not. Why not? Because it's terrible. You're terrible. Why are you yeah, so judgmental? <laughs> because I'm just naturally judgmental with everything. Well, that's true. If I bought one for me as well, would you wear it then? If I bought one for you, would I wear it then? No, if I bought... Wait, hold on. If you bought me one. If I, yeah, I I'll, buy, one, I'll other... buy us both one is what I mean. We'll both wear it. You know? Mm, no. Why not? It'd basically then be an inside joke. It's a great joke though. We'll go to J we'll go to EB Games and just hang out, you know. And act really cool. You're allowed to just hang out at EB Games. You're allowed to hang out in any store if you're excited you're window shopping. Yeah. Oh. Do you guys show windows? <laughs> Boy, dude, that's hilarious. Do, we, do you guys not sell windows? I was so sure. Man, you're on your A games there, I must say. It's Stephanie, a please insert <laughs> the Donkey Kong not funny you didn't laugh again. Thank you. Trying to be funny. <laughs> you just said. <laughs> what were you trying to do, my baby? What were you trying to do? I thought it was funny, Bill. You're saying it to entertain you, or saying it to entertain me. Everything you say entertains me. Uh. <laughs> it's a weird compliment. But no, no. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, it's all of the really serious and deep and personal things that I say about myself that entertain you. Yeah, my That hilarious. you think are hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> Liam, I think I'm in love again. Ha ha ha! Oh god, my friend. Liam, I'm, I think I might kill myself. <laughs> yeah, for that. Go on, man, it'll be a laugh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> That'll be a pretty funny joke if you're to my mate. I feel bad though if like people have gone through like a roller coaster of like, they're gonna 100% it, yes! Oh no, they're not. Okay. I knew the words for just like Tiger Woods by Steel Panther. What, what the freak? Didn't, wait, about how he did something? Wait, didn't he do something? Who? Tiger Woods? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. I mean, 
like he is like a, the world's most famous golfer or whatever. The world's like, most successful golfer. That's the one. Well, and most famous, I'd say. Well, he might not still be the most successful golfer. I feel like he went through a controversy as well. I don't know what it was. Yeah. Um, I don't know, man. What was it? Well, maybe that's what the Steel Panther thing is about. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, a little bit more powerful. Than mm-hmm. he was mm-hmm. Yes, he, could, he did. He, he did that thing. What? Someone strike him down. No, I strike him down. Holy shit! Remember? I strike this guy down. He's become more powerful than I could have ever imagined. Oh. Oh my god, I died. Basically, a new he hope. is my old man. A new hope and the Empire Strikes Back. Well, basically, a new hope is a really. I think it's a good movie. But, but, you know, oh. I've seen it so many times and I know how the story goes, so it's hard to appreciate it as much. I can agree with that. Do you get that with a lot of things where it's like, you've seen it so many times that you're just like, I don't know. I think I, my, I'm like that with Ocarina of Time, which mm. is another game that I'd like to play one day on the channel. Yeah. But I've played that game so many times that I really, I feel it's, I feel it's difficult to appreciate it. That's why I've been watching a lot of uh, randomized speedruns, <laughs> where all the items are randomized. Oh. I kind of want to make a play for that. Maybe if we ever do a play for a fucking time on the channel, we'll do that, huh? Randomized one. Yeah. Maybe. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, it might be entertaining. Something a bit different. Mm. Although, then again, you, have you ever finished Ocarina of Time? Um, no. Oh, well, maybe we should play a good traditional run then. Mm. How far did you get? I remember in high school, you had an emulator for it. We all did. And you didn't realize you could Z-target. And you would take a million years just to defeat the first boss. Because the controls were jank. I took a little bit longer than the rest of you because I didn't know I could see target it. Yeah, it is part of the tutorial area. I would just look around, aim, and bam. Yeah, I got a red moon. Please tell me that that is a joke and that you have not been paying attention the entire it's time. It's not the first one before. <laughs> Thank God. Oh, they're red now. We're only literally like near the end of the level. Well, not really. We're kind of halfway, I'd say. We've got to climb well, I this. can't see him. This is the final building. Showdown so at Bowser's Castle. Wow. I don't have time, by the way. Um, I feel like we're definitely past it. Mm, probably. Yeah. Alright. Next time on this... Bowser's Castle. Ne next time on Bowser's Castle.